So we're here at the Forza Motorsport 5 event in downtown Los Angeles. Now, they let us in early for a sneak peek at the event before it even starts. What I can see is that there are people lined up, everybody's excited, even I don't know everything that's gonna be going on at this event tonight, but what I can tell you that I'm excited about are seeing some great cars and playing Forza Motorsport 5. <laughs> celebrating the launch of the Forza game and it is one incredible game. It's as close to reality as you can get and uh, it takes gaming to a new level. Our platforms are defined by the exclusive games. Those are the games you can only find on Xbox. Dan and the team have done an amazing job. I mean the game looks incredible. Being able to finally uh, take a full advantage of the Xbox One and the power the Xbox One brings. You drive cars for a living, all of you. So what does it feel like to be behind the controller on this new game? Well, it, it didn't go so well for me. I, I, I crashed straight away, so... It's great to have open wheel and Forza 5. I played for a long time since number one. <laughs> Forza has always been, like, my game on Xbox. I wasn't the first person shooter guy. I always wanted an indie car in the game. I'm very excited about having indie racing in because it's just a fantasy of mine to be able to drive like that. <laughs> excited about a new feature called drive -atars. and what we do is we actually capture a lot of your behaviors as a driver so we're learning about how you race and then we're taking those characteristics we're sending them up to the cloud to Xbox Live the end result is you actually get to race against your friends even if your friends aren't actually online playing against you I'm noticing a decal on this lovely lovely car what does it mean this is a Forza McLaren ride which is a unique experience at the Goodwood Festival of Speed this year one lucky fan from anywhere in the world who goes into Forza McLaren ride and enters the competition has the opportunity to drive up the hill for the first time in the P1. That is a big deal to a lot of people. Let's sum up the evening, shall we? I got to see a sneak peek of Ron Howard's new film Rush and one of its stars, Chris Hemsworth, stopped by. Got to see some killer cars. Got to beat my Forza Motorsport 5 record and Oh yeah, may or may not have talked to an Indy 500 winner, Tony Kanaan. So all in all, I'm calling this evening a win.